Hello, and welcome back to Jolly Roger Hobbies. Today we're going to be doing an unboxing of the Amazon bundle with the Sigma 18-35 1.8DC HSM art lens. Here on my channel, I do videos on general hobbies which include model building, RC aircraft, planes, helicopters, etc., video games like Star Citizen, photography, geocaching, anything to do with aviation, and I also do product reviews. I put links to items that I showcase in my videos in the description, so be sure to check that out. Be sure to like the video, subscribe, and hit that notification bell so you'll see when I upload a new video. Also, feel free to ask questions in the comments, and I'll do my best to answer. And feel free to converse with one another, but please do it in a respectful way. At the end of the video, I'll give you prices and why this bundle is a good thing. But as have you noticed, I have not opened it yet, so let's do that now. And as in true Amazon fashion... There's a box inside of a box. Which I'm a little upset about. Because after all, this is a $639 bundle as of this moment. And yet, it was bouncing around in there. Let's just hope the stuff inside here is packaged. Packaged well. Looks decent enough. So, you know what? I'm going to set this box right in front. I'll just pull them out. First and foremost is the Altura tripod and cleaning kit, which you get pretty much free. I'll open that in a minute. The Airbags backpack, which has a inflatable pouch in there. This unfolds into a sack. Honestly, I'll probably never use that. Our 64 gigabyte uh, SanDisk SD card. Class 10 high speed. The Sigma USB dock. And then, of course, our lens, the 18-35 f1.8 DC HSM. And by the way, this is for the Canon mount, because my camera is a Canon. So, at first, let's open the uh, lens. First thing you get, of course, is your warranty information. Your manual, documentation, warranty sticker, so we'll set those aside. And straight off the bat, it comes in a nice little carrying case with a belt pouch if you prefer. I don't know anybody who would use this, but those of you out there still might, so... Then, the good thing is, is this lens is well packaged. You've got a nice foam top with a cutout to hold it, keep it from rattling. Inside, you've got your lens hood and a foam bottom as well. So, this is a nice little case. And, of course... Your 18 to 35 millimeter Sigma lens. Now, I am not going to be doing a review on this simply because there are hundreds, if not thousands, of reviews on YouTube for this. So, I'm focusing on this bundle specifically. If you'd like to see reviews on this, please do a search. There is tons. 
And if you're like me, you're going to watch a dozen videos anyways because I always do my research. Next, of course, which comes with every Sigma lens. This is not just with the bundle. This is coming with, well, I don't know if it's every Sigma lens, but every 18 to 35 it will come is your uh, lens hood. And the good news is it's a bayonet hood. Not a screw on that screws onto the filter element. These are the type of lens hoods I prefer and the only ones I'll use on any of my lenses. And I'm really happy that Sigma includes this with the lens. That makes me very happy. Next, of course, is your SD card, which we've all seen an SD card. I'm not going to open it for the sake of the video. We'll skip that. Next is your Sigma dock. And, of course, I can't get into it. And I'll explain the Sigma dock in a minute. And, of course, in here is your same instructional sheet, warranty information, and sticker. And then your cable and the dock itself. Which is really neat. It does come with a cover for the uh, contacts. I really like that. And then the airbag pouch, which I'm not going to demonstrate. Um, I'll put a link to a video that explains this. It is the manufacturer video. And I'll put a link in the description for this, if you're interested. And then I'll go ahead and open this, just so you can see. Kind of nice hard shell case. This is a cleaning kit and a little pistol tripod in here. And, I mean, it's a nice little carrying case. So, there's your uh, spray bottle for lens cleaner, your brush, your blower, a strap, of course, your uh, microfiber uh, lens cloth. Oh. And you got to, oh, these are the uh, uh, microfiber, um, they're lens wraps, basically. So that's kind of cool to have those. And then this is your little pistol tripod. Which I can't seem to get into it, so you know what? I don't care, I'm not going to be nice. Screw on right there. Okay, got it. So, and put your camera on that. Nice compact little thing, I have to admit. Kind of cool. I may or may not use it. I don't know. We'll see. All right. So, enough of that. So, you get the, again, the entire thing you get with this bundle. You get the cleaning kit. You get a strap. You get a tripod, a nice little case, a couple microfiber Lens cloths, a lens wrap to wrap your lens in, keep it clean and dust free. You get your dock, your lens, of course, the backpack, sack, whatever you want to call it, with the airbag, and your SD card. Those all come in the bundle. Um, there will be a link to the bundle in the description. Now, the reason why I'm doing this unboxing is simply because there are no videos for these unboxings for the bundles. Why is that? Because Amazon just created these bundles for the Sigma lens. This is brand new as of a, about a month ago, maybe two months ago. And they've been going like hotcakes. And I mean literally like hotcakes. They sell out 
every single time they get them in stock. I had to be on a waiting list to get mine, which finally came in today, and I'm happy to show you. Why is this important? Good question. You can get the Sigma lens by itself for $629 as of this recording. $629 for the lens and the lens hood. And of course the caps. That's it. That is all you get. However, now with this bundle for $10 more, $620 or $639, excuse me, you get everything you see. Now, like I said, the lens was $629 by itself. Your Sandisk card is $10. Okay, that's cheap. Yeah. So pretty much $629, $10, there's your $639. So everything else you get them free. The main important thing is right here. This is the whole reason why I bought this bundle. For the lens and for the Sigma dock. Yeah, it's cool to have an extra SD card. Always cool. This dock is $60 on Amazon right now. 59, I think it's 59 even at the moment. And some are even selling for higher depending on where you shop at. We'll just say $60, call it even. So, your total would be $500 or $699 for these three items if you were to buy them separately. Not counting any of the other stuff. Not counting at all. $699. So buying this bundle for $639, you're saving $60. That's a significant amount when you're a poor person like me and you save up everything you have just to purchase this lens. Now, why is the doc important? One of the things in your research you might have heard is that the Sigma lens has trouble. It's either front focusing or back focusing, which means that if my hand was the focal point the lens will focus here or here. This is back focusing, this is front focusing. Now, before you quit and get upset, it's not the lens's fault. It's your camera's fault. So, well, it's a combination of both, actually. So the lens and your sensor of your camera have to line up absolutely perfectly to get your focus. That's any lens, any camera, I don't care the brand. The problem with that is, one, you got two different manufacturers here. I'm working with a Canon lens. This is a Sigma brand. And you even get this with Canon and Canon lenses. And Canon cameras and Canon, Canon lenses. Blech, I can talk, I promise. So, how do you fix that? With um, modern uh, or more expensive cameras, now I want to say the ADD and some of the others higher, the Canon specifically, and probably a lot of other manufacturers have a adjustment in your menu settings where you can adjust the focus so you can adjust that on the lenses. My lens or my camera is a Rebel series and unfortunately the Rebel series is a lower end market camera and it does not have that. I cannot adjust my focus on any of my lenses through the camera. So I have the Canon T7 Rebel T7i just so you know. Now the problem with that is how do I fix that if this does not focus correctly? Well by Canon standards, I have to send this lens and my camera into Canon and they will adjust it in the factory. 
and I can do that with any lens. In fact, they suggest you send it with multiple lenses. Well, if you've got more than one lens, you might as well send them with all lenses so they can adjust that per lens. Sounds great, except for one, you've got to pay for shipping. Two, you're out of a camera and lenses for six to nine weeks, ten weeks or more, depending on however the backlog is, how long it takes them. I don't know about you, I can't live that long without my camera. I need it. One for this channel, two for my photography, and everything else. I can't deal with that. So, there's another option. Introduce Sigma. Thank you, Sigma, very much for this. And I wish other manufacturers, especially Canon, would do this. So the Sigma Dock. What is What this is, is like I showed you earlier, this is attaches to the lens. You take this cord, USB cord, plug one end in here, the other end into your computer. And guess what? You can, not only can you adjust the focus, but you can download and upgrade your firmware for this lens specifically. And yes, this lens, just like all modern lenses, actually have a circuit board in here. They're all programmed. So you can adjust the firmware to the newest and adjust your focus. You can go in yourself on your computer and adjust the focus so that way everything lines up. Not front focusing, not back focusing, but lining up. That is what you want and that is what this dock will give you. Not to mention, it's not just for this Sigma lens. It's only for Sigma. It is a Sigma dock. However, most of Sigma's lenses will, this dock will accept those lenses. And so you can adjust those as well. And I praise Sigma for that. Now, me at home, I can adjust my focus, update the firmware, all from my home. And it only takes a couple hours. You have to shoot a photography target and then download the picture onto your camera or onto your computer see where the focus is, and then you have to manually adjust it. I've heard it's a pain in the butt. I'll find out. Hopefully I won't need to, but you never know. If I do, so it might take, what, a couple hours for me? Or I can sit in into Canon for six to ten weeks. No thank you. So therefore, this bundle is more than worth it. I paid $10 extra for the bundle instead of just the lens. And I get the dock, the card. These are the three things I bought it for. But bonus, you get a nice cleaning kit, which funny thing is there's a cleaning kit that comes with almost every single lens and every camera out there sold now. So I have tons of stuff. But that's neither here nor there. Get a nice little traveling pack. And your Airbugs backpack. So, is this bundle worth it? In my opinion, absolutely yes. And we got everything we wanted, and it looks in good condition. So now, I can't wait to play with the lens and find out. This is an excellent, excellent lens. And like I said, I'm not going to do a review on it. You can check it out for yourself. So, hope you enjoyed. And thanks for watching.